it's your girl Malay, and welcome back to another video. This is how me, a beginner, did this eyeshadow look. It's like my fifth time in my life doing eyeshadow, and I completed this. Like, I did this on me. So, if you want to see how to get this look or just how to dabble into the eyeshadow world, just keep on watching. And don't forget to like this video, turn on my bell, post notifications so you can be notified every single time I upload a video. And follow me on my social media, my Instagram, it's Malay. My Snapchat and my Twitter is at DZ with three E's, T-Y-X-1. After you've done all that, let's get into the video. Welcome back to my channel, you guys. How have you been? I'm back, y'all. Hey. I don't know what the video this is going to be. This is an unplanned video. I just decided to film. So here we are. I'm going to be doing my eyeshadow. And if you don't know, I am a beginner at eyeshadow. I just started doing eyeshadow. I'm going to show you guys two looks that I created. Cue the pictures. The first one is the orange one. It's like the orange kind of look that I created. And the second one is like a red Valentine's Day look. Okay, this is like my first ever high-end eyeshadow palette. I consider this as high-end because I never spent $40 on an eyeshadow palette ever. And to be honest, I'm going to be real honest. I heard of Jaclyn Hill, but I like I didn't know what she looked like, so I didn't buy this because of her. I bought this because I want Morphe.com, and this was like the first palette I seen, and it was just like they was promoting it a lot, so I was like, hmm, get this one. You can tell like I put some use into it, especially with this color down here. I tried to clean it up a little bit, but I made more of a mess down here. But this is the palette, very very creative, very flexible, has a lot of colors. There are 35 colors in this palette you know i love it i'm gonna be showing you guys how i do my eyeshadow as a beginner i'm still learning so you know i probably i'm gonna be making some mistakes just correct me like if you are don't bash me just correct me tell me what i'm doing wrong give me some tips and pointers because like i said i'm still i like to prime my lids and i like to prime my lids with this concealer this is what i use this is no name brand concealer at all this is three dollars at the hair store and this is what i'm going to be using to apply my base i'm going to be using this concealer if you really want to know the name the name is hd concealer literally it's dirty, you can't see it. By, I'm gonna put the brand right on the screen. And I'm gonna be taking this purple right here, Therapy Sesh, and I am gonna be putting that on my lid. I have my purple shade packed on to my liking, and now I'm about to go in with more of like, like a blending kind of brush. This is the Morphe M506 brush. I'm gonna be going in with the shade Lolly Mama, and I'm just going to be using this pink shade to blend out the purple shade. So now I'm going to be adding Not My Journey inside the little crease to darken it up and give it like some dimension and shadow. Okay, so I'm about to do something very risky and I might mess up this whole eye look because I've never done this before. I'm going to attempt to cut my crease. So I'm going to draw like a little line going down on my eyelid. I'm going to look up and that is where my crease placement is going to go. So I'm not going to cut my crease on camera because I'm nervous. I'm done with the eye. I'm about to do my face. If you want to know about anything that I'm using for my face, just ask and I'll be happy to tell you. If you don't know what 
color correcting is it's when you want to cancel out your dark circle or your dark blemishes and hyperpigmentation and stuff like that you use like an orange concealer to cancel that out and you go on top of it with your foundation Makeup. Oh, wait, 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 hold on. Okay, you guys, this is the finished makeup look by your girl, yours truly, Melissa Vaje. I did this. This is all me. So on the eyes, we got Jacqueline Hill, a little cute little butterfly cut crease or whatever. Yeah, this is my finished look. The video was mainly focused on the eyeshadow, and I feel like I did a pretty good job on this eyeshadow if i do say so myself i want to thank you guys so much for tuning in and watching this video if you liked it don't forget to give me two thumbs up you can comment down below what you liked about this video or comment down below your instagram name so i can follow you don't forget to follow me at bts my life my instagram and for my snapchat and twitter it is at dz 3 ezyx one thank you guys so much for watching again another shout out to jacqueline hill for creating this bomb bomb makeup palette i love it i really do everything is perfect the colors are perfect it's very good for beginners it has a lot of neutral shades and a lot of um shades that you can play around with so i decided to play around today this is the palette you can get it at morphe.com it was 40 dollars and yeah, I think that is all for this video. Thank you so, so much for watching. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye, guys.